Do you agree with that? Amen. If you agree with that, and, and that's the reason why Jesus was troubled, I'm going to go ahead and have my sleep. <laughs> Do I? I think I'll just sit down. <laughs> no. That's the problem. That we've been sitting down after sermons are over and said, oh yeah, he died. Because <laughs> I close out every Sunday with the fact that he died. I know some of you get bored, but he died. For you and me. That's why it is after a while it becomes a longest service in the month. My mind. The people who are caretakers here said, oh, if it's going to be the first Sunday, they're going to be late. <laughs> There's something else that I want you to leave here knowing and never, ever forget. The 20th verse says that he was troubled. I need to know why so I can celebrate with you the Lord's Supper in no uncertain terms. From this day, March the 1st, 2020, is that we won't have people carelessly walking in here on the first Sunday to get the sacraments and leave and never knowing why Jesus said, celebrate the Lord's Supper. Baptize in my name. Amen. So our subject today, oh, you thought I would never get around, <laughs> is trouble at the table. Yes, sir. Oh, no. yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! I get enough trouble on my job. Don't you? Oh, yeah. I get enough trouble uh, uh, actually living in my house. I get enough trouble dealing with people that just don't want to listen. Mercy. And if you're a pastor, you can get trouble in a bunch. All right. Yes, sir. Every day. Mercy. As soon as you fix your brakes, <laughs> your window won't come down. Yeah. <laughs> as soon as you A star comes through and take the roof off. <laughs> trouble! Yeah. Have I got a witness? Yeah. Now trouble being defined both in the Bible dictionary as well as Webster is a difficult period. Mm -hmm. It's, uh, as been described by one commentator, it's a grave <laughs> with the ends cut out. You just trouble. <laughs> How you doing this one? Oh, I'm just. <laughs> Where you going? <laughs> just marching in trouble. Yes. 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 And just don't know yes. that I can't do anything except cause trouble. trouble. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. Help me I even go to you. that greater church. <laughs> and I walk in the door and somebody steps on my yes. <laughs> my last toe. <laughs> and we got a witness. <laughs> it's just <laughs> So I don't feel so bad now because now I found out that even Jesus had trouble. Yes. Mm -hmm. At the table. such a way, this was the day of the celebration of unleavened bread. Mm -hmm. And rather than having all the joys that heaven provides, there was trouble. Mm -hmm. Let's think 
let's look real quick. It's right here in the Bible. Yeah. In Matthew 26, mm -hmm. 26 through 28, it talks about Judas betraying Christ. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How many would agree? Raise your hand. How many would that's that's trouble? Yeah. Have I got a witness? Yes. Yeah. In Luke 20, 21, it will also say that. Judas's betrayal was struggle. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. And Mark, it will also describe the same issue with Judas's betrayal. Uh -huh. And so I thought, and maybe you would join me this morning, <laughs> that trouble is when someone betrays you. Lord, Especially someone that you trust. Amen. And we got a witness, right? I want Jesus to be able to trust me. Don't you? Amen. So when I don't do what Jesus is pleased with, it is a matter of betrayal.
or Cain and his mother. It was trouble because Cain couldn't get along with <coughs> or I'm coming close. Say nothing to anybody. So, so I 